And the next time we see Miranda, she'll be very, very slightly heavier. Just a fraction. Hello? Hi there, here I'm one of the embryologists. Hiya! Yeah. Um, I was just letting you know how you've done from today. Okay, brilliant. So you've got, all of them actually are blasted. Oh, is amazing! Oh. Which is really, really good. That's so fantastic! Oh, I'm so happy! Oh my goodness! <laughs> yeah, usually out of four, you get one, so to have four out oh of four, goodness. that's really, wow. really, really above average. Oh, Lovely wow! Out. Oh, I'm so happy! Oh, what a relief! Okay. <laughs> so I can see your best one, okay. which is what we call a 5AA. What that means is the uh, 5 means how well it's expanded. Okay. So it's expanded to a stage where it's already starting to hatch, wow. which, is, which is really good. And then the AA, is that there are two types of cells. One is the inner cell mass and one is the outer cell mass. So the inner cell mass eventually becomes the fetus. Okay. And the outer cell mass eventually the placenta. All right, okay. So A's, you can't get a better than A's. Ah, amazing! So, so that one is a clear winner to go back. <laughs> okay, brilliant, love All that. All right. And not far behind is a 3 AA. So okay. that's going to be frozen. Okay. You're all right with that. Yeah, absolutely. And then there's an, another one which is a 3 AB. Okay. So that's also freezable. Oh, wow, brilliant. But unfortunately, the fourth one isn't freezable. It's a 3 DC, so it's more on the other side of the spectrum. Okay. okay. But to have like one really good one and then you've got some to freeze, you've done, you know, well be beyond above what? Average. Yeah, brilliant. Oh, yeah. thank you so much. So well done. <laughs> <laughs> thank we didn't do anything. <laughs> you did. Oh. <laughs> your genes. <laughs> oh, yeah. Um, what will happen is, I mean, are you guys on your way in, I guess? Mm -hmm. we're lit we just sat in the car when you called, so we're about to set off. Just park up and we'll call you i'll call you when we're ready so you don't need to ring because there won't be anyone in reception to collect get your phone you know, oh. your phone so so i'll just ring you when we're ready okay and then we do the transfer and then you can go back down again All we'll right. give you your give you your instructions in terms of what to do what not to do till pregnancy tests and all, all right. that sort okay. of instructions fantastic all right thank you so much well done ah, <laughs> thank you thank you bye bye, bye. bye. That's so good. That is good. That's amazing. I looked, I looked at the numbers thing yeah. before, and the four or five AAs, between three AA and five AA, yeah. are the best. There's a chart. Wow. Oh, it's a shame our wonky one can't get frozen. What's our wonky one? A 3DE? A 3DC, did she say? Or BC? We need... To... Oh, here we go. Oh, that's it. There you go. That's what we've got. <gasps> what? We've got... Best. Best. Yeah. What? And then we'll that, insert the picture of this. And I think that's the other one, isn't it? So the one, we've got one, mm -hmm. two, yep. three, and, and then... And then, <laughs> like, oh no! The one that got away! Three is fine, that's one baby! Woo! <laughs> Off we go! It is, I haven't got my watch on! Ah! It is 10 to 8 on Monday, the 22nd of March, 2021. We're in the car, we are driving over to our fertility clinic. You'll just have seen our embryologist on the phone to us telling us that we managed to get three embryos! Well, four. Well, four. four. One yeah. of which is the wonky one that didn't quite make. Yeah. Oh. The one that got away. But the one that got away in the eternal, I'm immortal going. words of Katy Perry. I mean, we can't complain. We're so lucky. They're going to implant the top dollar one. Um, and Tris is not allowed to come in. Apparently the room that they do the procedure in is teeny, teeny, tiny. And the rumor happens. That, we've said that before in vlogs, haven't we? Many times. Uh, many times. <laughs> um, but yeah, many times. It's very small. And in the room, they will have a consultant, an embryologist, a nurse, me. And is there another member of staff? There might even be a... Wow. You some stopped. bloke off the street to try and... And some bloke off the street to chilly us. <laughs> um, Fun. Be what? Um, but yeah, look, either way, the room is going to be full and they said with COVID, it's just impossible to try and like ventilate that. Um, so Tris unfortunately can't come. However, out of everything that we're doing, this A is the shortest. It's literally going to take five minutes. And B, there's no new news 
we've already received the news on the phone so it's not like Trish is going to miss out on anything so that's fine you'll just sit tight in the car so I'll have to go in by myself I've had to drink two pints of water at seven o'clock our retrieval is in 10 minutes at eight so they need my bladder to be full I think so that it's easier to get to my uterus so they can see a bit better and we're just feeling very grateful I can't believe it you'll have heard on the phone the umbrella just said that to get four eggs and then all four fertilizer go to blastocyst doesn't happen statistically we should have got one uh so well statistically obviously that's that's the case but it just doesn't happen She's like this this doesn't happen so happy this doesn't happen we were meant to be you realize that i have realized that many times over our relationship hence this hence that. otherwise i wouldn't have done that oh i'm not a single lady sorry that was the wrong <laughs> song to sing <laughs> oh, i'm a single lady no no Miranda. god damn it oh we're here we're here this mark is on your windscreen every single time we drive here. It just doesn't come off. You've done this before. It's inside, doesn't it? Oh, oh maybe. Oh, <gasps> is that space? No. <laughs> no. Damn it! We're going out again. <laughs> to so go back in. A bit more B-roll actually of coming into the hospital now, so that's quite nice, Lu isn't it? Lucky you guys. So I just drove over. What? A box of the gold fries. <gasps> we get out. That's a good sign. Oh my gosh, let me explain. There have been so many lovely ladies who have messaged me on Instagram as we've been documenting all of this who have gone through IVF or are currently going through it or are about to go through it and give me advice and stuff. And one of the ladies messaged me last night and she said, whatever you do, make sure after your reimplantation, although she called it a transfer, I don't know yeah, if she's American or- No, what? embryo transfer is the right word to use. Why do I call it implanting then? Because that's the word you decided to use for it. Oh. It's called your embryo transfer. Well, I've been using that wrong all the time. Well, maybe I've coined a new phrase. Anyway, she said, she said that it is tradition within the IVF community that when you have your embryo transfer, you have to have McDonald's fries afterwards. I, I was hardly gonna say no to that. So we're gonna have McDonald's fries afterwards. She, I mean, she sent me a blog post all about it and there's a very strange reason. They say it's so salty that it forces your body to just absorb all the moisture in you and then your uterus becomes super cushy and sticky so the embryo decides to stay whether that's true i don't know but i'm happy to have mcdonald's fries if someone tells me it's going to help the situation so it's very early mcdonald's only does breakfast at the moment so we're gonna have to wait until a little bit later but that's fine i can wait for my fries um team time here we are outside our hospital i'm leaving you i love you love you too Mwah. <gasps> ah, gonna go get pregnant <laughs> bye bye I love you so much. Love you too. Do it, follow baby. Arthur, pictures. Pictures. Pictures, pictures. Yeah, okay. of sperm and eggs, Can yeah? You text me as well. Yeah, yeah, I'll, I'll do it. it. Okay. I love you. And the next time we see Miranda, she will be very, very slightly heavier. Just a fraction. I'm back in my trusty car park where I seem to spend half my bloody life. I just think it's mental. The whole IVF thing and how it works. It blows my little mind that over the last five days they have been growing our children in little dishes and they're about to pop one back in. I And I, I can't get over the statistics. We were so, I say so downbeat, we were quite disheartened. And, and yeah, we were downbeat about having only four. Because from 13 and you're told you have 13 antral follicles and we were like oh my god amazing we've got like so we're on our podcast test your baby shameless plug we mentioned it and we said we think and Ryan was like i think we're gonna get all 13 and i think i went for nine so we weren't far off each other oh can i send off and that's why it shocked us so much during egg retrieval or post egg retrieval to only have four and we were really yeah we were really disappointed so from those four, to have all four mectoblastocysts is so good. Like, we were expecting if we got, let's say seven, four of them would be mature and we'd have like two in the end. To have four, we were then like, ah oh, shit, we're gonna end up with like two that are mature, maybe one of them might make it a blastocyst. If not, it will be a day three implantation, which is like rolling a dice. Today, in theory, the implantation and the success rate is like flipping a coin. It gives you, such a better chance getting to day five. Ooh. Hello? Hello. Oh, hello. We're allowed, we're allowed to FaceTime. Oh, this is novel. So you can see. Although you can only see me right now. <laughs> 
Morning. Morning all. Everyone's oh my goodness. Long as you just keep company. Yeah. Um. Miranda, keep concentrate on you instead of put the bladder. Yeah, my very full bladder. <laughs> <laughs> I'm going to put a bit of water. Okay. It's too big to be made. Because we can't do the table gel. Because of the ember. Oh, I see. Okay. Yeah. Oh my god, Miranda, your bladder is oh, so full. I'm so uncomfortable. <laughs> <laughs> Did it not need to be that full? No. Oh. Because you got a tiny bladder. I have got a tiny bladder. I'm going higher again, it's going to look very tiny to me on the screen. I've had to shrink the flush now. Oh my goodness. I can see everything now. Okay. <laughs> what we're looking at is... Oh wow. That, that lake is your bladder. Oh my goodness. That's one of your ovaries. That's the uterus there. Okay. And the lining is here. Okay. All right. And we're going to feed the catheter through here. Wow. And put it about there, all right? All right. Okay. I'm going to tilt you slightly. Okay. All right. There's like a lot going on. I know. Well, yes, there is. They're trying to get me pregnant. I'm ready, please. Hey. I'm ready. Yeah. So can you just see that bright white there? Yeah. So that stops about there. Okay. All right, so uterus is here. That's the outer part of the catheter there. Oh, wow. Okay, all right. What would you prefer, a view of the screen or a view of my face? Maybe the screen. Okay, fair enough. You see my face. Your fa I see your face all the time. <laughs> uh, I see your face all the time. Thanks. It's a lovely face to see, don't get me wrong. Wow. Well. Well. Okay, now I'm just going to inject. Flush the fluid. Yeah. Yeah. Where the white is. Wow. That's where the fluid is. See what it's oh. Right, so Amit's now checking the capacitor to make sure it's really Yep. It's in. It's in, it's in. Woo! <laughs> he said that one looks like me, one looks like you, and the other one looks like both of us. That's perfect, it's what you want. Embryos are not, are not gravity induced. Alright. I'm not going to fall out. Okay. So you can definitely empty that lake. Okay, thank right. you. Over the next two weeks. Yep. Yeah. I kind of want to wrap you up in the wall. Okay. Alright, because we want you to look back at the side. We did everything we could. Oh my goodness. I can't. Wow, that's crazy. Well, guys, I am pregnant until proven otherwise. Do you know what's crazy? Most people who are pregnant at this point do not know they're pregnant and won't know they're pregnant for another like, what, two, three weeks, easily. We've got the date where we can do our pregnancy test. And um, obviously the sex is always already determined, which is nuts. Why are you laughing? Obviously the sex is forbidden, I thought you were gonna say. Oh, sex is forbidden. We are allowed, we are allowed to have sex for two weeks. The sex. the sex. I think it's a girl. I think, I, I think, I think it's a boy. And do you want to know, whoa, do you want to know something interesting? Last time that we were pregnant, I was convinced it was a boy and it was a girl and Tris was right. So, oh no, what was that? A dead fox. Oh, that's a bad omen. It's just a dead fox. Bro. Okay, sorry, I need to stop reading into things. Um, I think it's a boy, which means it's probably a girl. No, I think it's a girl, which means it's probably a boy. Yeah. Guess. Who is finally getting her McDonald's chips? This girl. This girl. For medical I've not actually, I've not actually reasons. seen this message. I don't know if it exists. I think you're just angling for McDonald's. This is what we like to see. I'm not actually just getting chips. I'm going to get a full McDonald's. I'm going to be allowed to do that. Part of the whole IVF thing. You've just said it's, it's chips. Or should I just have like, chips first? <laughs> Can I please get? Um, three large fries. Uh, yeah. Three large fries. Yeah. A large Fanta. A large Fanta. Yeah. Two apple pies. Two apple pies. Yeah. And um, a dairy milk. Sorry. A dairy milk McFlurry, please. Do any of them have sauce with them? Those ones. Nah, sorry. That's okay. There's no sauce knocking about anywhere. Tris. Like, if you've got them. Ignore him. Uh, <laughs> uh, can I then get a? I'll have two Maltesers one then, please. Yeah. 
And that's it, thank you. Oh, perfect, thank you. Thank you. Cheers. You are so cheap. So I live for the sauce. The sauce is why I have it. You have to be nice to me because I'm with child. I'm so upset. <gasps> oh my goodness. Oh god, don't stop, don't stop, don't stop. Thank you. All good? Is that everything? Is that everything? Oh. Yeah. oh, sorry, thank, thank you. What if the world had more of your smile? What if the wind could spread your love? What if your sweetness could reach everyone? There'd be no wars.